Katie Whitaker, a guard on two Sweet 16 teams at Texas Tech, takes over as the Lady Raiders coach. The team will have to replace all five starters from last year's NCAA team. Coach Whitaker's um, brought a lot of energy to the program. Uh, she really, she really cares about the players uh, in practice. You can see that, but we also meet with our coaches outside of practice. It's just a change period having a new coach. You know, in my third year, but I like the fact that she lets me play my game and. She just puts me out there and says play, so it's more comfortable. She's really tough. I mean, she expects nothing less for us to go hard in practice, uh, wants us to execute, uh, really focus on the details, so um, tough coach, tough team. The expectations haven't changed just because we're a little bit less experienced. Um, we go out and practice every day and we work hard, and we have the expectations to be a winning team. We'd like to play fast, ideally, but um, we're going to always do what we're, we're best at. I think that's our job as a staff is to adapt to them. Um, we're really athletic, so just to get the ball up, we're fast, so we can kick the ball ahead, transition team mostly. With no returning starters, it's a new start for everyone, and the Lady Raiders will count on a talented freshman class. We look at it as a new opportunity, um, opportunity for people that are returners that haven't gotten to play as many minutes because they were playing under so many upperclassmen the last couple of years. Um, we just have to take the lessons that the people that are, aren't here in Kelsey that they left behind, and we have to build on what they left, their legacy, and. We just have to, we can't dwell on the past, we just have to keep playing hard and play for each other, see where it gets us. Everybody has to work hard because there are no roles yet, nobody's earned a spot yet, so it's always going to be really competitive. Well, they're going to have to play, uh, there's no question about that, and, and they're talented, I think that they can. They're going to make freshman mistakes and they're going to have a learning curve to adjust to this level of play and Big 12 play, but um, we'll have to be patient with them and, and understand that it's a learning process. A lot of them will have to step in and, and play bigger and older than they are. We can't do it without each other, so to, to play for each other and to win for each other and to win for our fans, it, that's all that matters.